Hi everyone, it's Natasha of natashaskitchen.com. Today we're making chicken tetrazzini. It's a creamy, cheesy pasta bake that's loaded with juicy chicken. And everyone who tries this loves it. We start with cooking 12 ounces of pasta, and I'm using thin spaghetti here, but you can use any pasta you have on hand. Cook the pasta in salted water according to package instructions until it's al dente, or firm to the bite. While the pasta is cooking, prep the rest of your ingredients. You'll need four cups of shredded chicken. You can get this from a cooked rotisserie chicken, which is the easiest way, or you can season and saute two pounds of chicken breast. Break the chicken apart into bite-sized pieces and set it aside. Now thickly slice one pound of white mushrooms. Finally chop one medium onion, then mince three to four garlic cloves. Now finally chop a quarter cup of fresh parsley. And for your last bit of prep, squeeze one tablespoon of fresh lemon juice. Once the pasta is finished cooking, drain and rinse to stop the cooking process, then set it aside. Place a large Dutch oven or heavy bottomed pot over medium-high heat. Add two tablespoons of olive oil, then add the sliced mushrooms and saute for about three minutes or until softened. Add the diced onions and cook for 5 to 7 minutes, stirring occasionally until the onions are soft. Add the minced garlic and stir for another minute or two, just until the garlic is fragrant. Then remove the mushrooms to a separate dish. You'll make the sauce in the very same pot and there's no need to wash it. Melt four tablespoons of butter, then stir in a quarter cup of flour. Cook for one to two minutes, stirring constantly until the mixture is lightly golden. Then add two and a half cups of chicken broth, a tablespoon of fresh lemon juice, a teaspoon of salt, and a quarter teaspoon of black pepper. Stir until smooth. Finally, stir in one and a half cups of half and half, or you can use equal parts of milk and heavy cream, and bring everything to a simmer. Taste the sauce and add more salt and pepper as needed. Add the pasta, chicken, and mushrooms back to the pot, then stir in a quarter cup of fresh parsley. Stir well to make sure every noodle is coated in that amazing sauce. Sprinkle the top generously with one and a half to two cups of shredded mozzarella cheese. Cover the pot and bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes. Then remove the lid and continue baking another 15 minutes, which creates a golden cheesy crust. Oh, <laughs> come to mama. I am excited because this made my house smell amazing and it's delicious, so let's get right into this and do the taste test. Okay, and you wanna break through that cheesy crust. The crust is awesome because it seals in all the juiciness and makes this pasta incredibly creamy and not dry, not at all. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> creamy and cheesy. Oh, and because one scoop is just not enough. <laughs> mm. Okay, and then garnish with a little bit of fresh parsley because it gives it that beautiful pop of color and flavor. And here we go. All right, get a little bit of everything on my fork and the chicken is like melt in your mouth delicious. All right. 
<laughs> Seriously though, that chicken is so tender. And then the plump, juicy mushrooms. Oh. <laughs> and the sauce has amazing flavor. It just bakes into every noodle, so every bite is incredible. I hope you guys love this recipe. It's a family favorite. If you enjoyed this, please give us a great big thumbs up below. Make sure to subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time. Oh, and one more thing. This reheats really well, making it perfect for lunch the next day. And if you guys love easy, family-friendly recipes, check out some of our family favorites right over here. And click below to subscribe. And when you do, click that little bell icon so you'll get notifications every time we post a new recipe. We'll see you next time.